Hello again, it's Joey John McGuire in my favourite um, London watering hole in Fulham on North End Road, the Cock Tavern. I've been coming here uh, most days for the last, oh, I think about a year, 18 months. About to recite my latest poem. Uh, almost finished my new book. A little bit prolific this year. Uh, and as you can see, it's nearly finished. There you go. My latest poem, Wishful Thinking. It is a dull, dank, damp and dismal day with a nasty, nippy little chill in the air. Last night saw me double up on the duvets. My sixth sense must have told me it was coming. There is little noise emanating from the world outside, and yet it's way past dawn. Running late, my bones are reluctant to move, weighed down and nestled comfortably. They're wallowing in sixteen inches of memory foam, and I've been lying here as many hours. My body must have needed it, as mo most nights I struggle to sleep for only two hours and I suppose I'll make a concerted effort to rise, as there's no sleep left in me now. Mind you, my stomach is growling, and deep in the old subconscious I'm aware that she might be there, because it's Thursday, and that's her day. I promised myself faithfully that I would resist, but when my mind gets made up, it finds it hard to let go, especially when the heart is involved. And it doesn't help that she's beautiful, and I'm known to be a sucker for a size eight. Cold doesn't factor when there's love in the air. My stomach is lead-like, having consumed two Weetabix, like I've been self-medicating for two weeks now, and I wonder if she'll notice the weight loss. That's if she's there and I don't miss her, not avoiding me as she's done before, and even if she is there, I wonder if she'll notice me at all, being as it's been four weeks now, and still she has not called.